Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I am here today with my husband. Say hi. Hello. Hey. Uh, thank you guys so much for all of the love on the last video that I post making slime with him. We really appreciate it. I'm really glad that you guys enjoyed that video, and I know it was kind of random, but we had a lot of fun with it. So today, I'm really excited. It is my makeup birthday. So my birthday was actually two weeks ago, but I was in bed with kidney stones, as you guys know. So today is actually my makeup birthday. I'm really excited. We're actually going to go to my favorite pet store. Um, it's about an hour away. I've taken you guys there one time before it was the angora bunny video which i will link for you guys down below if you haven't seen that pet store tour but we are going to that same pet store it's my favorite i'm really excited they have a lot of birds there too um the reason that they have so many birds is because the guy who owns the place is actually like a lover of birds so birds is like the biggest animal that they sell there but i really love going and looking at them and i kind of want to try and hold one so we'll see another thing that i do want to mention that you guys are going to see in this video is this is the same pet store if you guys remember that has the huge custom enclosures for the reptiles. I love looking at their reptile enclosures because they're so big and they're not overcrowded usually. So I'm excited to show you guys those again. Also, this is a pet store that has the huge hermit crab enclosure. They have a really nice hermit crab enclosure every time I go. It's like this big corner tank. So you guys will see that as well. Another thing I want to mention is that yes, this pet store does sell puppies and kittens. However, they also rescue and adopt and rehome cats as well. They have a designated cat room just to cats that they are rehoming. So while they do sell puppies and kittens from local breeders, I believe in the town that the pet store is, they do also rehome animals as well. So I don't know, it's something. But I'm really excited. I hope you guys enjoy going along. We are leaving right now. We'll be there shortly. I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you. <gasps> Hi, excuse me. You don't mind if I film the animals, do you? Do you mind? Thank you. Oh, they made me so happy. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love them so, so, so much. Mm -hmm. Only they stayed this time. Milo did. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Oh man, they're precious. Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> oh man, he's beautiful, isn't he? Yeah. Oh, so pretty. I've never seen one of those in person. He's a rose worth of cockatoo. Lays on his back and lets the rubbish in. Isn't it so pretty? It is. Okay, let's see if I can get any. Look at this. Step up. Oh, baby. We're not doing that today. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was like, I feel something hitting me. The other day, I think. He's a way more work. Okay, so not, I think they're in the same broad family, but they're so pretty. Yeah. <laughs> How much is the bird? $1,700. I mean, it's not like a crystal vase, so you ain't gonna break it. You're okay. And then just put your thumb on his foot. 
Come on. Yeah. Oh, it's so pretty. You're so pretty. Did you like walking around? I did. I love that store so much. Everything was really clean in there and everything looked really, really good. I was super happy. All the hermit crabs were in natural shells, as you guys probably saw. I'm always so impressed with their hermit crab habitat. I think that's one of the most biggest reasons I love this store. Also, they had a ton of puppies, which is really disheartening. I know you guys always comment and say, you know, that you don't like stores that sell dogs. I know it's a really outdated thing to do, but it's like, that's kind of like one of the only things they do negatively here, shockingly. And it's only because they have a lot of local breeders that contact them. They do have a ton of really huge enclosures. I love that their bearded dragons are like one to two bearded dragons per enclosure and each enclosure is bigger than all of the ones at Petco or PetSmart where they keep like 20 baby bearded dragons. I think they only had like three bearded dragons total here like little baby ones which is amazing. I love that they never overstock their tanks. All of their fish tanks are huge and there'll be like three fish in them. I just always really appreciate how huge the enclosures are here and a lot of them are custom built. It's definitely one of the reasons that I keep coming back to this store for sure. And I loved holding the birds, that big bird. It was so large. It was crazy. That's like the largest bird I've ever held. And that cockatiel was so cute. I did not want to put it back. It was so, so sweet. I definitely had an awesome time. I hope you guys enjoyed touring around the tour with me. So I think we are going to go eat now. I think we're going to go to Penn Station because I'm starving and they have the best subs there ever. <laughs> So we're just gonna run in Petco really quick. I just need to pick up a couple things. Let's go 
look at the birds. I love birds. I just got to pick up some dog food and I got some bedding for Moo. And then I also really need some crickets from Lemon as well. This pet store is like really quiet and they don't have a lot of animals here. It's kind of surprising. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in my next video. Be kind. Bye.